Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my very first makeup tutorial and I'm going to be recreating my clown makeup look that I did back in 2018. Um, that was a part of a Halloween series that I did that year and you can find the pictures from that series on my Instagram. I will link my Instagram down in the description below. I hope you look forward to seeing how this turns out. If you do, please like and leave a comment down below. But if you're new here, hi, welcome and go ahead and subscribe. I would love to have you here. And don't forget to click the notification bell next to the subscribe button to be notified when I upload my next video. Um, other than that, let's get started. Okay, to start off with, I am just going in with a little bit of foundation from my base, blending it in with my damp sponge, and you can just use whatever sponge and foundation that you have. I will link what I'm using down in the description below. Now I am just blending in a little bit of concealer under the eyes, around the nose, on the corners of my mouth and on my chin and blending it down to my neck. Okay, now it's time to prime the lids. I'm just using Revlon Colorstay Eyeshadow Primer on my top lids. And I'm just going to let that dry down a little bit. I'm going in with this terracotta colour in the Total Temptation by Maybelline. It's a shadow and highlight palette and I'm using this just as a base on the lids. Use any colour you like just to give the eyes a little bit of uh, pop and I have chosen to go in with a nice kind of deep um, cherry red I guess you could say and I've just got a big flat brush and I'm just packing it on with the flat brush and then blending it out with my fluffy blending brush. With a eyeliner, I'm just going to outline the triangle on my forehead and the triangle that goes down towards my cheek under my eye. And after I do this, I will be filling it in with an eyeliner as well. I can't remember what this eyeliner is, so I won't be listing it in the description below. I just know it's a double-ended one and I'll be using it again later in the video. to filling the triangles I'm just using the same eyeliner to fill in the triangles and then I'm just going to finish it off using a matte black eyeshadow you can always do this using um, black face paint as well the circle uh, dot red dot on the tip of the nose I used a red lip liner but you can always use a red eyeliner or uh, apply red paint face paint using a small paintbrush and then I filled in the circle using the lip liner but then that wasn't really working very well because it kept breaking on me so I went back in and used the liquid lip to fill in 
the circle on the end of my nose. I just filled my lips in using the same liquid lipstick as I did with the nose. Just apply the lipstick like you normally would to the lips. I decided the eyeshadow was looking a little bit more pink, so I want to darken it up. So I went back in with the same eyeshadow and just went back in and blended more out on the lids. And just applied some gold shimmery eyeshadow to the corner inner corners of my eyelids and then with the lip liner i used it to extend the lips out towards my ears and i made the line as thick as i wanted and i filled it in with the pencil and then i smudged it out using a flat liner brush just to pull it out towards the ears and make the line a bit straighter just like you can see me doing here just extending the triangles by adding a line using a black eyeliner off camera, I also added white mascara to my eyelashes. Sorry, I didn't realize I wasn't filming this part, but I got the black eyeliner and used it to outline the red dot on my nose. And I also outlined the bits of my lips. Again, I'm sorry, but off camera, I stamped on some stars using that double ended eyeliner I was talking about earlier. I was running out of eyeliner on that end of the pen, so they didn't work out very well, but there you go. I've gone ahead and added gold highlight to my lips, my nose, the bridge of my nose, my cheeks towards my forehead and now I've gone back into that red I was using before and applied it to the blend brush. I am now blending it out down the sides of the triangle and also around the edges of my mouth. much for watching I really do hope you enjoyed this makeup tutorial I had here for you today and if you did and you would love to see me do something like this again with different looks please leave a like and comment down below I'd love to do a Halloween series here on my channel in the future and if you are new here I would love to have you here please go ahead and subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified when I upload my next video. But until next time, stay creative. Bye.